Hey guys, US Ghost Guard here. Today we're doing a tutorial on variables. Uh, before we start, I want to apologize for uh, the crappy audio quality, but I'm using my computer's mic at the moment. So, we start off by placing a unit, double click on the unit, and it's in it. We're going to put my variable equals, and then the amount. So, if your um, variable is money, say you just want to back like uh, uh, you know money or whatever. I'll just put 100, and um, and then if you want to hint how much money I have, you put this right here. Uh, it's uh, I'll put that in the description. It just pretty much hint. I said hint. It's, yeah, so hints here. I'm out. So let's start off here. So you can see in the uh, corner there it hints our money alright so now what we're going to do is press S to save your mission I'm going to call this uh, the total type 20 ok we're going to save it and now we're going to okay. go to my documents Come to other profiles, the profile name, missions, and you're going to find your mission. So now that you find that, you're going to go to Notepad, and now here comes uh, the more complicated parts. But I'll, I'll tell you. That. So basically, we have this few lines of code here. Um, and what this does is it puts a value on something. So the cost is the amount of uh, money. In this case, it'll take away. So we're going to put like that $100. And uh, the name of your variable, the variable in this is my variable, is uh, what your money is going to be, is what it equals here. So if your money is greater than the cost hint you do not have enough cash sorry you can change that to whatever that just hints if the player doesn't have enough money else your money equals your money minus cost and then the little code here I have in the description which will hint your money and then here right here we have an action if the player does have enough money. So this will pretty much take the player's money away and uh, give them what they bought. So we have player 1, add weapon, MV, G, MV goggles, and then that's it. This little part right here, it just, for example, this just gives them night vision goggles if they have enough money. And um, my variable equals your money again. That's just a check. I will add this code in the description, so let's go on to the next part. Alright, now you want to save this as what I call it by dot sqf. Um name it whatever you want. Um and then put dot sqf right here. This part after it that makes an sqf document which is a uh, code. So then you want to go back to your mission and now uh, you see it's empty so you just want to put it to all files not text document all files and save it. Alright so let's go to the next part. Alright now we're going to make the seller. It can be anything. Um, but I'm just going to make it uh, independent civilian. Let me see that. We'll turn him around. Face the uh, player here. And now we're going to go in its in its end. We're going to put this add action uh, bracket uh, quotation marks, and then the name of the action, which would be by MVGs. And then we're going to put the price, you don't have to, 100. And close it up with the quotations, put a comma, another quotation mark, 
and now we're going to put the name of our file that we saved the script as. So die.sqf, close it up, and then close it in with a bracket. Okay, now we're going to preview. A second. It worked, but our character does already have um, light vision goggles, so what we're going to do now is we're going to remove them. Now that we have our light vision goggles removed, let's go and add them. Is that okay now? It's strange we don't have them. That's strange. One moment. I did find out the problem. And is that um, we forgot to name the player? So the, uh, the script says player one, so it's a name in the player. Right now that we've named the player, it should work now. We have nothing. And now we have night vision goggles. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry for the quality. If you'd like more tutorials, make sure to like, favorite, and I'll see you all later.